Welcome back everyone. Welcome back to Let's Play Fallout 4 and Porter Gage's cooking show. On tonight's show we will be cooking some kind of a weird stew. Porter, tell us more about it. Porter? Uh, ladies and gentlemen, he's not interested anymore. Uh, thank you for watching and uh, watch the commercials, bye! Uh, anyway. Lab coat. Stim pack. Yeah, we found this, um, tower in the Kitty Kingdom. And... what is it? Okay, on tonight's show, etc. Anyway, we found this Kitty Kingdom tower here, and I think it leads down into the tunnels? No, it doesn't actually, but we did get the Nuka Tunnels... Nuka World Tunnels key. Or Kitty Kingdom Tunnels key. So anyway, we're reading Rachel's terminal. The user logs. Uh, in the previous one, they, they were joking about taking over this place if there was a nuclear war. <laughs> We've got our defenses set up now and things are starting to look a little bit better. Thanks to my background, I've sort of become the unofficial doctor of our raggedy little bunch. Oswald has been so supportive and he's continued to manage this whole crisis like a real leader. I'm so proud of him. Whatever that horrible radiation storm did to us, everyone is having bad reactions, but there are others literally dying from it. I wish I could do more to help everyone, but I'm an organic chemist, not a surgeon. I don't have the heart to tell people that as they're dying in my arms, so I just keep it to myself and try to give them hope. The affliction. My good friend Fran succumbed to the affliction a few days ago and I've just seen a wreck. Dean and Oswald boarded her up in a house before she tried to attack anyone, which I don't think I could have taken. Oswald stayed the night up here and just held me while I cried. I tried to apologize to him for falling apart like this when he needed me to be strong, but I knew her since elementary school and I couldn't hold it in any longer. I hate this place. There was a huge attack this week that pushed us all the way back to the castle gate. Just when we were about to fall back to the theater, a bunch of the afflicted started crawling uh, out of their houses and started helping us out. But as our attackers were retreating, my body froze when I saw st a stray bullet hit Dean and it looked like he was dead, but Oswald did something. This glow came out of his body, flowing like a wave. Suddenly Dean started breathing again. After the attack ended, we all looked at Oswald, who started muttering something about using real magic. Most of us didn't know what to think. Me? I don't care what the hell you call it. Maybe we can use it to cure the affliction. Either way, I gave him a huge kiss for saving Dean's... life. <laughs> That's on the next page. We've tried everything we can think of, exhausted every option. Not even Oswald's powers can seem to stop the affliction. There are only a handful of us left and we're running out of time. I don't know what will get uh, get us first. The raiders who moved into Nuka Town or the Affliction. So that's it. I've talked it over with Oswald and he is going to stay in Kitty Kingdom to keep everyone safe while I go, find, uh, go to find a cure. I felt awful leaving everyone behind, especially Oswald, but I really have no other options. I'm going to head over to the town of Bradburton near the park and start there. This is a huge gamble, but it better pay off. I suppose it didn't. Official casting for King Cola's court. King Cola, Leo Mendoza, blah 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 blah. Other cast. Assistant, Cola Clowns. Rob Lois, Systemera, Corruption Detected. Safe control. We are not interested in safe control because we are going to unlock it ourselves for a, you know, pittance of an XP. Ow! If I don't break all my bobby pins, of course. There we go. Sweet. Uh, fusion cells, gamma round. I'll take the pistol as well, I suppose. And that. Yes, I need all the laser pistols we can get. And I'm running out of this. I'll start using the laser rifle. Alright, let's get out of here. Okay. And we still have to find that... Oh, we're on this side now. Where the hell are we? We're on the wall. We still have to find that hidden cappy. Oh. It's telling us to go here. This is where the tunnels are? King Colas Court. 
No, I don't want to go in here. Uh, it could have been hidden back here, couldn't it? Well, cigar box and there's a bomb underneath it. That was interesting. I suppose this was for employees here. I don't know. Okay, so no hidden cappies here. Bloody things. Yeah, nothing. I don't want it to go back to the court again. Not really interested in that. Uh, we need to find the tunnels and the hidden cappy. So hidden cappy, as you can see, there you go. It says it's here. Okay, now it's disappeared, which means we're very close to it. I still want to check that place, because we just went in, into that building. And uh, I didn't really look around for a cappy, I forgot to do that. But I want to check it more thoroughly, because it's so tall, and there's so much. I mean, you know, so many places where it could be hidden. I wasn't really looking. Let me check everything. There's nothing here. Am I making sure I'm checking everything? There's so many different walls and angles and... Nah, I wouldn't... Oh, wait a... Oh my god, did I really miss that last time? Yes! I got everything! Yes! And that's all ten clues. Oh my god. Better get these back to Sierra and see what you can make of them. Oh my god, we actually... That's... That's just... Ugh. Oh, that was not a fun... I hate these types of quests. I'm sorry. Hey, man. How's it going? Oops! Sorry! Sorry! <laughs> Alright, so we have to find the tunnels. How do we find the tunnels now? Kitty Kingdom, Ferris Wheel, Fun House. Oh, I need the thing from the Ferris Wheel, don't I? Um, Precious Metals. The World of Refreshment and Among the Stars. Oh. And Nuka Galaxy. Ah, there's too many to collect. What do I get for that, anyway? So how do we get... No, Arnold! How do I get to the tunnels now? Where do I find them? Jeez! Take it easy. There's another bomb here. Well, I suppose that's alright, because they were trying to defend this place. And I suppose radiation just does the trick, doesn't it? Why are these floating in the air? That was weird. What's Gage doing? Oh, he's getting hit by that ride, I suppose. Baker, Baker, pastry maker. Shoot and slash and bite and break her. <laughs> Am I on the right track? Because he's talking? I don't know. Oh, that doesn't lead to the tunnels or anything. My radiation has gone up so much. I kind of don't like the fact that radiation simply just reduces your health. Uh, in the previous fallouts, you know, in one and two at least, it uh, severely reduced your special stats. But I suppose that would be even more annoying in this game because you get, you know, overloaded and and you cannot walk. I mean, run, blah, blah, blah. So we've already been here. How do we get to the tunnels? This is the Ferris wheel. One of the main reasons why I want, want to find all of those uh, medallions, whatever they are, is to get rid of the quest so I can clean my quest log. <laughs> Which I have a feeling I never really will, because there's so much stuff in there, but... I like, you know, I like clearing stuff. What is this place? Hello? Can anyone tell me how to get to the tunnels? And... What are they? I suppose maintenance. Hmm. 
Oh, wait a second. Employees only. That's good. Oh, this looks promising. Yes! There it is. Employee tunnels. Finally. We found them. I suppose there's going to be a lot of ghouls in here. Nice. Yeah, this laser rifle, this seemed to, um, to charge up. What is that bowl doing here? I wonder what the level designer thought. I'll put a forklift here, but also a bowl. <laughs> I mean, I suppose, you know, that maybe someone, maybe the story is someone was eating. That is a lot of rads. Give me, please, a rad axe. And a rad away. Nom, 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 Oh yeah, of course, we're, we're outside. No, I'm Arnold. Walking to water. Oh, wow. The right away didn't actually do it all the way. Interesting. So we didn't waste it, quote unquote. I am happy. Microscope. Those are good. Oh, wow. Look. Someone has been uh, growing stuff here. Can I harvest this as well? Thank you. Harvest. Oh, yeah. They've been living here. Well, I'll leave their stuff, I suppose. Even though it seems it's only Oswald left now. They got a pretty nice place, though. This much dust. No one's been around in a while. Oh. This area is huge. Why would they have such giant tunnels underneath the, the place? Probably military stuff again. Okay, refugee terminal. You can Ah, oh, crap. Alright. Let's do it. Out of power armor. What is that over there? There's a lot more to this place hmm. than you think at first. Wow, I see my hands. <laughs> Haven't seen that in a while. User logs. Dr. Morris. The enemy finally dropped the bombs on us. Thank God we had the plan and everyone stuck to it. We couldn't talk sense into all of the park visitors, but we were able to grab a few out of the stampede and take refuge in the employee tunnels. Oswald and Rachel did a pretty good job stocking up down here. We've got preserved foods and seeds, water from the pump systems, tools, extra lumber, just about everything really. Except for weapons. That was Mitchell's job and we don't know if he survived. We just gotta keep calm about about this and ride it out. <laughs> ride it out in a theme park. It's been about a week since the bombs fell and we'd all written Mitchell, uh, Mitchell off for dead. Then he comes rolling up in a semi half full of guns, explosives, food, medicine, chemicals, you name it. Said he'd been busy gathering the rest of what we'd need to fortify Kitty Kingdom. He had some blood on his shirt, but when Oswald started to ask him about it, we all told him to just leave it alone. I mean, Mitchell's a crazy bastard, but right now I'd rather have him on our side. I certainly wouldn't want to go up against him. We blew up the service tunnel passages connecting to the other areas of the park. If things don't calm down in another few weeks, we'll head outside and barricade the gates. The fighting outside has died down a bit, and we've barricaded the gates to Kitty Kingdom. While we were finishing up, a weird storm started to blow in over the horizon to the east. We barely had time to finish up, and when it hit, it hit hard. I've seen all sorts of storms, but this one was different. Almost like a tornado with green lightning arcing through the sky. We all ended up taking shelter where we could, but a few people just got sucked into the vortex and we were just gone. We were trapped for hours while that crazy storm passed over. It must have picked up the fallout from Boston because everyone has been sick for weeks now and quite a few have died. Those of us who haven't are changing. The preparedness videos never said anything about this. We've been alive here for over a hundred years now. The change has affected all of us. It seems as though our bodies have adapted to the radiation. Our features have become twisted and distorted, but we no longer felt ill. Unfortunately, it seems like this change has affected some of us worse than the others. First it was Mitchell, now Herman. They aren't speaking anymore and they seem to just shuffle around growling. If we try to hold them back, they start to get violent. We've tried everything we can think of, talking to them, medication, every possible remedy for a cold or illness, but whatever this affliction is, we can't seem to beat it. Rachel's convinced that it has to be an illness of some sort. 
The rest of us just call it the affliction. I pray we find a solution before it takes us all. Interesting. Oh yeah, back in my power armor. That's how I roll. Yeah. All right. Did I loot this? Yes, I did. Yeah, they got a really nice place here. And I suppose Oswald is the only one last standing. I'm what not are you doing out of costume again? You know Nuka fires people for breaking character. <laughs> yes, of course, I'm kidding. But seriously, the clown makeup helps scare the invaders off. And there's a new one in the park. No, no, I don't think that's going to work this time. There's something different about this one. See? I can do that too. Now, stop squirming. I wonder if I can hit them from here. <laughs> Zero. Zero chance to hit. Yeah, okay, so there's... Sorry. I know you can't help it. We just have to hold out till she gets Whoa. back with a cure. Then we'll drive the raiders out and get the farm back in order. We'll fix this. I promise. Aw. Hey, man. You and me. Search the tunnels. There we go. I've completed it, but... Okay. I still haven't uh, talked to this guy. Kitty Kingdom Tunnel Scheme. Well, I already have that. Pump control system. Ah. System access. System warning. Safety warning. Unsafe levels of radiation. Administrative override. Turn off mist sprayers. Excellent. Uh, okay. And user logs. It's been a few weeks since the bombs fell and we've been attacked for the first time. It wasn't even a big group, and they weren't as well-armed as we were. During the fight, I froze up when some grocery clerk charged Evan from behind. He was knocked to the ground and was about to have his head bashed in with one of those gumdrop decorations when Mitchell blew the clerk's brains out. Now Evan is pissed at me for not watching his back. The damn world has ended and I have to deal with a pissed-off boyfriend. It's been a few months since the radiation storm started. 23 people have died so far, and I'm starting to wish I was one of them. My skin looks like a prune, at least in the places where it hasn't fallen off. A couple of the others seem to have stopped changing, but they look terrible. Half of my hair has fallen out. Another clump just fell out while I was typing this. Evan's hair is gone entirely, and I can barely stand to look at him. We had a huge fight about it, and now he's moving his stuff out of here and up into the clock tower. I felt like a monster chasing him off, but maybe it's true. Maybe I am a monster. Maybe we all are. Some sort of alarm woke us up in the middle of the night. It looks like the water intake pipes are contaminated. I mean, the water is practically glowing. The alarm must have been some sort of automated failsafe to protect the park. We'd all heard rumors about Nuka World having some sort of reactor in the bottling plant. God only knows what they put in that quantum stuff. The heck with it. It's been over a year now. If the radiation from the storms hasn't killed me yet, what's a little bit more? I'm going back to bed. We were attacked by a huge mob today. They almost made it to the castle this time. As we were trying to drive them back, I had an idea. We may be immune to radiation now, but these people probably aren't. I ran into the tunnels and turned on the park's water sprayers. In minutes, the attack was over. Man, we should have been doing this for years. When Evan heard it was me who figured it out, he kissed me until I couldn't see straight. I, I don't know if it means things are totally good between us again, but hell, I'll take it. The affliction sweeping through our people is getting worse. It took Herman last month. He knew it was coming, we all did. Until Rachel can figure out some way of fixing this, I'm afraid we're all going to end up like that. We've survived radiation storms, starvation, attacks, and God knows what else for over a hundred years now. But how can we fight this? It's not fair. I don't think I'm just angry, or if this is a sign that I've got the affliction. Can't help us all. Okay, so we've uh, turned off the, uh, the sprayers. And that water looks bad. What is that over there, actually? That radiation is shooting up! Woohoo! 
Military grade circuit board. Alright, we can take all that. Oh, there's nothing else here. Alright. Yeah, Gage, don't come back down here. It's it's bad. So now we still haven't cleared this ah, la, la. we still haven't cleared this place out, but we've searched the tunnel, so I'm assuming the final confrontation is uh about to begin. Oh. All right. Join me on the roof of King Cola's castle, and we'll see an end to this production. All right, let's do it. New cool world. But of course, we'll see what Oswald has to say oh no, next time. You shut oh. off my defenses. Oh wait, I'll just turn these back on. Huh. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.